We're going to have a look at the Pimeroni uh, Displayotron 3000. This is a really nice sort of LCD shield that just sits on the Raspberry Pi. Uh, it's got a three line LCD display. Uh, it's got three strips of RGB LEDs in, so you can make the display go different colours in different strips, which is really neat. Uh, it's got a very, very bright bar graph of white LEDs here that I'm going to show you in a minute. And it's got a four-way joystick here, which is perfect for navigating menus and also for making a radio. I love making Raspberry Pi radios, so imagine how excited I was to discover that this comes with a radio module. Radio module also has a very cool clock. Look, check that out. That's the clock module. It's got a binary clock. It's also got different options on there. You can turn the binary clock off. It Also, you can set it to dim at night so it doesn't keep you awake. Lovely little touch. Uh, the volume control here will show you just how bright these bar graphs are. So you can turn the volume up and down and the bar graph will follow. Each LED is addressable individually, which is nice. And the thing that I'm really interested in though is the radio. And I've added some of my own favourite radio stations. So if I go up to stations here, I've put usual BBC radio stations in and some that you can only hear on the internet, like FIP in Paris, which is my favourite radio station. Let's hear what they're doing. Oh, a bit of jazz, nice. And let's see what's going on over on Six Music. Um, World Service News. It's abandoned any effort to collect pieces of wreckage because of the lack of any security agreement and from Moscow. Meat market, meat transmission. Resonance FM. And Share Radio, which is a new financial and, radio um, station. It's on DAB and online. Fairly direct one is how does a company embed and sustain the high ethical standards? And that's pretty much it. So anyway, that's the Displayotron 3000 from Pimeroni. It's sitting in a Pibo Coupe, which is a sort of cut off Raspberry Pi case. It's sort of half height, enables you to get to get to all the pins and all the gubbins so you can plug in things like the Displayotron 3000. Really easy to assemble, bit of fiddling around with the code, no soldering required, which is important for me. I don't do soldering. And it's made a really nice little Raspberry Pi internet radio. Very pleased with it. Well done, guys.